much further. Our line start at the top of the next hill. Come on. Wait a minute. Now, now, come on. We've got to keep moving.
Checkmate, King Two. This is White Rook. Over. Checkmate, King Two. This is White Rook. Over. This is King Two. Over. This is King Two. Over. Captain, it's White Rook. He just broke radio silence. My drug. This is King Two. Over. I can't read you, King Two. Over. He faded. Any idea where he might be? He was supposed to contact our line here at 0700. And he should be somewhere east here, this ridge. Take some men and try to pull him out. Yes, sir. And Hanley, we need that information. Yes, sir. Checkmate King 2, this is White Rook, over. Checkmate King 2, this is White Rook, over. Checkmate. King 2, this is White Rook, over. Checkmate King 2, this is White Rook. <laughs> Who's there? Don't move about. You're in a ruddy minefield. Who's there? Answer me! Name is Miller. I'm British. It's your eyes, isn't it? Put the pistol down, lad. I'm coming in to help you. Your chums had it. Now then, try to follow me very closely.
Now then, I think we're out of it, Sergeant. Let's have a little rest. There's a tree directly behind you. Sit down. That's right. There. Now, let's have a look at those eyes. No wound. No burns. It must have been a concussion. It's just a concussion, huh? Yes, I think so. Miller, you've got to get me back to my lines. I told you I'd help you. No, no, it's not. It's not just my eyes. I have information, important information. Yes, all right, but you've got to help me, too. I've been carrying a chap with a bad chest wound. I had to leave him back in the trees there when I heard the mine go off. Well, what about a radio? Do you have one? Sorry, no luck. I'm not too sure where we are, either. Well, do you know where you picked me up? Yes. Well, there's a hill there about a mile away. Our lines are right at the top. Look, there's going to be a crowd push. I know where and when. We'll send somebody back to help you, buddy. I'm sorry, I can't do that, Sergeant. You see, my man is bleeding to death. But right, then I'll tell you what, I'll stay. You go and tell him that the... I'm sorry, Sergeant. I have no intention of leaving him. I took a splinter in my leg this morning, but uh, with your help, I think we can carry him. Now, Miller, I'm not asking you. I'm giving you an order. The rank is Major, Sergeant. Major. Major. Major, Major, wait. If the Germans come through here before we can beef up our positions, they'll run all over us. We won't have a chance. Sergeant, I told you I'm not going to leave that man here. Now, we can make it back to the lines together, or you can try it on your own. I'll bring him here while you decide. Major. Major, don't you understand what I'm trying to tell you? They'll run all over us. What kind of a soldier are you? I'm a chaplain, Sergeant. Sleeves. <coughs> you feel just like any other soldier. Oh, easy, easy. Oh, now, you must have faith. When we reach the American, don't talk.
Well, Sergeant, have you decided to help us? I have no choice. Let's go. <coughs> easy, easy, easy. Now, don't try to talk, Captain. It only makes the bleeding worse. Yes, I You give him one of your arms. Mm -hmm. That it sounds like like water. It's a stream. We've uh, got across it. I don't remember crossing any stream last night. Well, it's it's closer this way. <coughs> Easy. <coughs> steady, steady. Right. We'll get you back. How was he? He's lost a lot of blood. <coughs> What were you doing in this area? We were passing through your sector. Our lorry got lost. We caught it in a barrage. I'm in time to get the captain back ever since. Take any more chances of being spotted. You have to leave us here. Major, go back and tell him that there's a Panzer Battalion moving into the valley on the far side of the hill near Crossroads 3 0. 3 0, you got it? We are staying together. That's final. Chaplains, you know how many lives you're risking for the sake of two men? We'll get back to our lines, Sergeant. I promise you that. Now, give us a hand, Sergeant, 
There's footbridge down there. I'm not sure it'll hold the three of us. I'm going to take the captain across first, and then come back for you. Sit right down here. There you That information. We must kill him now. It'll be all right as long as he's with us. Besides, you'll bleed to death without him. I can't carry you alone. This sergeant is right. Our lives are nothing. If he lives, the whole attack will be smashed. We cannot take that chance. <laughs> If he tries to escape, you must kill him. No. You must. I'm a man of God. You are a German. I cannot promise to kill a man. Then I kill him. Now. Well, you can't do that. Don't you understand, Miller? This, this is war. It's my duty. No, no, please, please, pretty <coughs> Helpless. It's murder, it's not duty. <coughs> this is not a chapel, Miller. from a mine. And look at the stuff here. Gage, keep an eye out. Little John, leave the radio. Get the rest of you fan out and see what else you can find. King six, this is King two, over. French gun emplacement. Sergeant. 
He's bleeding very badly. The more we move him, the more he's going to bleed. Chaplain, why don't you go back for some help? They'll bring plasma for him. He's going to die if we keep on going like this. I'm afraid you're right. There's an entrance up there. Give me a hand, Sergeant. It's too heiß. Ich kann nicht atmen. Ich kann, ich kann nicht atmen. Stop, Sergeant. All right, shoot. Yes, Sergeant. We're both German. I mean you no harm. I used you, yes, but only to save a life. You said you were a chaplain. I am a chaplain. And what are you doing with a gun? You can be thankful I have it. Krauss wanted to kill you back at the stream. Why didn't he? I promised him I would do it. I had to, in order to save you. Don't make me do it, Sergeant! You haven't the barest chance of getting back to your lines without sight. Maybe. But I'm through carrying him. So now what are you going to do? You fools! Fools of you! Kraus wants to commit murder in order to keep you from escaping. And you, you're willing to die. For what? You're so dedicated to destruction, you can't see. It's all a waste. And what are you dedicated to, Chaplain? That you're going to shoot me if I walk out of here? If you walk out of here now, Kraus will die. Then you better kill me because that's the only way you're gonna keep me here. Turn! 
töten. Lass mich allein. Geh weg von mir. Das ist ein Kerl. Ich hätte ihn töten sollen. Coming from the other side of the hill, Lieutenant. There's a bunker over there. Let's check it out. In Bunker.
King Six, this is King Two, over. King Six, this is King Two, over. King Two, we're at Able Five, near the bunker, close to our stuff. What's going on? Over. some Germans on the other side of the bunker. The Sarge is down there. I saw somebody take him up in the bunker. Call it off. Call it off. We got a man in the bunker. Out. John, you and Cage circle around that way. We'll try to go in this way. There are Americans on the far side of the clearing. Our people are firing at them from the ditches. Jetzt. Oh 
Miller, listen to me. If I had the information, he would do anything to stop me. He would kill me. And you, if necessary. Wouldn't you, American? Wouldn't you? He does not answer. But he would do it. Because it is his duty. It is a soldier's duty. And it is your duty to kill him now. No. It is not my duty to kill. To kill us all if necessary. Need some bunkers. Here. Yeah. You'll be killed.
take it easy. Lieutenant? Yeah. Lieutenant, Panzer Division, massing for an attack near Crossroads. 3-0. 3-0. Kirby, call it in. Gage, give him cover. Lieutenant, one of them's still alive. Which one? He jumped on the grenade. He was a fool. No. He was a chaplain.